a child, but what is in me is greater than that of the world. I am a child, but what is in me is greater than that of the world. Is greater. Sing along. Is greater. Open your arms. Is greater. Is greater. Yeah, my child. But what is in me is greater than that of the world. Hello, children. Give yourself the champagne clap. Champagne. Champagne. Po. Well, you are welcome once again to the Creative Art Class. And as you know, my name is Mr. Nati. You are welcome. All right, children. In our last lesson, we learned about tissue paper design. And we said, before you can do the tissue paper design, you need your tissue paper. You need your felt pens. You need your paint. You also need your animal stamp. If you don't have the animal stamp, you can use bottle tops. Okay? And we said, when you put your tissue paper on the table, you pick your felt pen, and then you try to create border all around the edges of the tissue paper so you can do crooked lines you can do circles you can do strokes or zigzag and when you are done you go for your animal stamp and then you paint the surface of the animal stamp and then gently press it at the center of the tissue paper and then you take it off then you can dry it and use it for your decoration on your center table or the coffee table and remember if you don't have the animal stamp you can use the bottle top okay so you just have to apply some of the paint okay on the bottle top okay I have a sample here like this okay and then you have to apply the paint on the surface of the bottle top and then you gently do what you stamp it on it if you don't have your animal stamp and then you can use it to decorate your center table and i said if you have a beautiful flower at home you can put it on it and then you decorate your table all right so I want you to keep on trying it at home and you'll get it. Don't get, don't get worried if you have not be able to do it. You can still, yes, you can. Okay, please. All right. So this is the recap of what we did in our last lesson. So today we are going to do another interesting creative art activity. And the title is... Pencil holder, pencil holder, pencil holder, pencil holder, pencil holder. Okay, so what do you use the pencil holder for? You can keep your pencil in there, your pens in there, your brush in there. You can keep your felt pen. You can even keep your eraser in there. Okay, if you don't want to keep any of these things there, you can still keep your pegs, your pegs, your drying pegs, okay, in the pencil holder, okay, please. And it was made out of the toilet room tube. Remember, I told you to get your tubes ready. So, yeah, the tube in here. Is what I'm talking about. Okay, please. All right. So, that's the lesson for today. Pencil holder. So, you need your toilet roll tube. You need your paint. I have my red, yellow, green, and then the blue paint. 
you also need your paint brush with you you need your fine glue or the white glue okay please the fine glue if you don't have the fine glue then you can also use your glue stick the glue stick you also need that one so to do your pencil holder you need a piece of card also to do your pencil holder okay please all right so you also need a white sheet of paper a plain sheet of paper that can also help you to do your pencil holder you can see it is very very beautiful I can hang it somewhere in my room or in the kitchen or anywhere or can put this on your table and keep your stuff in there as a child that's why I'm saying I am a child but what is in me is greater than that of the world okay please now kids let's not waste my time let's start all right so first of all you have to do something called put your white sheet of paper on the table and do something called disordered painting if you look at it carefully you see this side has been what designed with a paint how did i do it just pick your paint brush first some paint and then you do disordered painting disordered painting means going up and down left and right everywhere i pick a bit of wood yellow i go there like this disordered painting disordered painting add more red everywhere so I scribble, I do this other painting on the white sheet of paper. Okay, please. When you are done, you dry it for a while. You dry it for a while. Okay, please. And then you pick your tube, the toilet roll tube put it on your table now when your design or the disordered painted sheet is dry you fold it into two and then so I'm folding so you can see So that's it and with your pair of scissors you cut why am I cutting I'm cutting so that it can fit the size of the tube so I'm cutting and make sure you are very careful so that you don't cut your finger so you can let mommy or daddy cut for you so now mr. Nati is cutting I'm cutting part of the painter sheet that is I put this one away and I, I use this one now this is where I use my fine glue so with your empty bowl I pour my fine glue into the container Yeah. And now with another brush, I spread the fine glue on the tube all around. I hope you are enjoying it. Pay attention, you can do it at home by yourself. It's not difficult at all. Alright? So now I'm trying to spread the fine glue all over the tube.
try to give it a very nice design. It's all about creativity and creative art is fun. Right, I'm done. Now, I will gently wrap the painter sheet all over the tube. So you can see I'm wrapping just to give it a nice design. Okay, all over. more the glue I'm wrapping it all right that's it so you see my tube is covered with a nice painted design. Is it nice, children? Yes. Give yourself the loud clap. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Wow. All right. Now there's a hole here. If I put my pencil in, it will drop off. It can drop off. It can drop off. If I put my pen. All my eraser in here, it can fall off. So what do I do? I need to cover the bottom of the tube. Okay, please. So that's where you use your piece of card. Your piece of card. You put it on it. Okay, please. And then with the help of your pencil, you just have to cut a portion of it. Alright? So I cut. Give it a nice design, I cut around. I'm cutting so that I can cover the bottom of the tube to avoid my stuff from falling or dropping off so that's it and I put it on I hope you can all see it yes please so this is where I use my white glue the white glue you can still use your fine glue, but I also prefer the white glue to make it more firm. Okay, please. All right, so I take, fetch a bit of the, and then apply it at the bottom of the tube. Moving around here. And then gently put it on it. And I press it for about five to ten minutes. Okay, please. That's it. And then you see the bottom is covered, and this place is open. That's where I can put my stuff in there so that it will not wet drop off that's it kids i hope you are enjoying the lesson so this is what you can do at home by yourself and you can keep your pencils your pegs your erasers your sharpness all in here okay please So this is how to do the pencil holder for you to keep your stuff in there at home. How do I do it? I said you need your tube, you need your paint brush, you need your paint, you need your fine glue, you need a white sheet of paper that you can do your disordered painting 
on it for you to get the design like this and after that you cover all around the tube okay please and after that because there's a hole here at the bottom you have to do what cover that side so you need a piece of card to cover the bottom of the tube and then you can dry it for a while and then you can start using it so i can even put my piece of crayon in there i can even put my bottle tops in there i can put my marker in there um color pencils in there and i'll keep it at home all right well done thanks for your attention i want you to look for the materials at home and try to sit quietly watch the video again and go over the process you can do it yourself give yourself the laugh clap so this is the end of today's lesson we did pencil pencil holder what did we do we did what a pencil holder we did what a pencil holder so this is what we did for today next meeting we are going to do another wonderful creative art design so i want you to get a piece of card like this from empty boxes empty window boxes empty soap boxes okay please and keep them for the next activity stay safe god bless you and i'll see you next time bye bye